Hey YouTube, Simon here once again for Fundamental Changes. Today starts the start of a brand new video series. We're going to do an introduction to funk guitar. I think it's going to be really fun, really enjoyable. So let's go and have a look at all these new examples for this lesson one. Let's get to those next. Okay, so the dominant nine chord is absolutely paramount and foundational to all funk guitar. So I thought we'd start here today. So there's two different varieties you can do. We're using an E9 and one is slightly easier than the other. Example one that I showed was the slightly easier version where you're gonna have nothing on the sixth string, seventh fret on your middle finger of the fifth, sixth fret on the fourth on your index, uh, seventh fret of the third on your ring or third finger, and 7th fret of the 7th on the 2nd string. Now that is a 9 chord shape there, but it is a little bit easier than the second variety that I showed, which is where you bar all the way through the top three strings with your ring finger. So that would be 7-7 seven, seven, and then 7-7-7 seven, 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 all with the same finger there. So a little bit more tricky that one. If you can do that one, it bodes really well for the future because then you have a finger free, you have a little finger free to do all these other examples. Try those out, see how you get on. Let's get to example two. Sixteenth notes form the foundation for most funk playing as well. So today I just wanted you to look at the muting side of 16th notes. We count 16th notes, one E and a, two E and a, three E and a, four E and a, and you're gonna have your right hand or your picking hand, I should say, for any lefties out there, going consistently down, up, 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 down, up. Okay, now one thing to bear in mind when you're muting are there are certain harmonic zones on the guitar, it's like namely stuff like 12th, 7th, 5th frets, there are others too. So I tend to lay my hand on and have all my fingers on when I'm muting if I can, just because then I avoid any uh, harmonic zones. So if you just lie your hand on there, and example two, as you saw, was just getting your 16th notes nice and tidy, down, up, 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 down, up. Nice and easy there. Let's get on to example three. Okay, example three here then is a little bit of a 12 bar funk pattern I put together for today. Quite fun, we've got the chords of E9, which we looked at in example one. We're then moving that up to the 12th fret to get A9, 14th fret to get B9, and then back again. And then on the very end, we've got a B9 down at the second fret, which is just the 14th fret, obviously down one octave. The pattern that goes up on here is you've got a 16th note pattern, down, up, down, up, that's sixteenths on the first beat. Then you've got two, and then you've got four mutes, down, up, down, up, and then back on again. So you've got one E and a two, three E and a four. Down, up, down, up, down, hold it, up, mute, 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 on. And then you're gonna put that through all of the different examples here. I didn't do this one at a slow tempo as well because that would go on for ages, but just break it down slowly, 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 and hopefully you'll get there. I'll see you next time for more videos. Hi everyone, I really hope you enjoyed this introduction to Funk Guitar Part 1. I hope you got something from it. Please subscribe to our channel where we upload videos every week to inspire you wherever you are on your guitar playing journey. 
Check out Joseph's website, Fundamental Changes, and his books on Amazon. And come and have a look at my channel, SDP Guitar, where I give you way more free guitar videos to inspire you in your playing. Subscribe there too. Take care. I'll speak to you soon.